Hello everyone, welcome to a quick video here on the channel, Try the Morph. Please comment, like, and subscribe, and remember to keep the comments in the comment section decent and non-offensive. And let's get into today's video. So, um, so far the United States has become like an unsafe country to actually live in. And, um... Since the beginning of January of 2023, we pretty much had a, a we pretty much had a bunch of mass shootings since um since all the way to, to um December of 2023, and we're a few days away from 2024. So um yeah um and here's the scary part: Vivek Ramaswamy wants to um. He he really wants to uh, allow everybody to be owning guns without background checks and, you know, just make it a guns for all. Everybody can own one and, you know, like have no background check. If you're a psycho, then you can own like an AR-15 and that stuff. And that, if Civic Realms when we were past that executive order where nobody would need like a background check to own a gun and that stuff, that was going to make the U.S. even more unsafe, and then, you know, 2024 could even have even more deadly mass shootings than, the, than in 2023, and basically, if you're like a Robert Card, and you own a gun, then you'd be almost like free to do so, when you don't need like background checks. Like, if you're even, like, um, totally capable of owning a gun, or if you have, like, some kind of, you know, mental health problems or whatever and that stuff, you can still own a gun under the Vedic Ramaswamy administration because of the executive order he, pa he would have passed. Saying that um, nobody needs a background check to own an AR-15 or a pistol or you know like whatever weapon messed up. Oh, yeah. Um, I don't know. Maybe let's include like knife in the weapons. Maybe a non-background check to own other weapons. Not stuff, not just gun, but maybe knives and deadly. I don't know. Maybe explosive. I don't know. I mean, yeah, it's scary to think about it. And I, I'm, like I said, many videos I've talked about how Vivek Ramaswamy is not fit to run as president of the United States, or is he right for America? Now, I have another video where I've talked about Vivek Ramaswamy is not right for America and that stuff, and, you know, it's kind of like how we would almost have, like, another young Trump who would be, like, you know, running in office because of... Well... It's pretty clear that Vivek Ramaswamy is pretty much gonna almost run in like Trump's shoes. Which is bad. And this is how we want 2024 to be. This is how we want 2024. Or, I don't want it, but maybe some other American people will probably want Vivek Ramaswamy to run. And stuff. But yeah, if Vivek Ramaswamy does get into the White House, then you could pretty much um, think it's a disaster. And here's the other scary part. If uh, Trump gets reelected and that stuff, he wants to destroy America. Now when he says he wants to make America great again, or save America and that stuff, it's all a lie. It's all a lie. 
Trump is going to go after whoever is against him, and Trump is going to, you know, it's almost like Trump being a Death Star and just using his laser that comes out of his mouth to blow up Earth. That's just how I look at a Trump re-election presidency. Now, Vivek Ramaswamy could do the similar thing, can do a similar, could do just some similar stuff where Vivek Ramaswamy could just ruin America for, you know, a lot of people. And don't, don't get me wrong on this. I mean, I, really, do you know how many mass shootings have taken place this year? I have 631. Not plus that. Put a plus on that. There could be even more mass shootings before we get into the year of 2024. And is that totally going to make 2023 the worst year we ever have? Yeah, but what was the worst, the most absolute worst year we've ever had? 2020. Because we also had a COVID-19 virus to deal with. Okay. So, 2023 being worse. Uh, 2024 being much worse. And 2020 being the worst year. Okay. Uh, I gotta say, um, 2024, there's definitely gonna be some real big problems. Because if we have, um, under the Vivek Ramaswamy administration where anybody can own a gun without a background check and that stuff, um, yeah, that's gonna be a huge problem. And we'll probably be even seeing more mass shootings in the year of 2024 than 2023. Because, well, that could just be the reality of it. And it's just, it's just not going to make the United States even safe to live in anymore. So in 2024, there's going to be um, psych psychopath monsters who just own AR-15s and pistols and knives and a bunch of other deadly weapons that are just gonna just go and blow up people out of, like, all forms of hate. Anti-Semitism? Um, re religious hate? Um, COVID-19 hate? Being Asian hate? And... Um, oh, and racist too. Race, racial hate. Yeah. And people don't need a background check. If that's what that co is going to come to, let's go. Then 2024 is looking to be, um, a bad year just like 2023. And, you know, um, maybe, 2024 is just going to be the most unsafe year for America. 2020 being the worst year we've ever had. And going into 2024 from 2023, which is a few days away, in 2024, we're probably looking at a really unsafe America in 2024, and that's just the reality of it. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like what's said here, please comment, like, subscribe to the channel, Charles Morse. Remember to keep those comments decent and non-offensive. And, you know, uh, I guess 2024 is just going to be the worst year for America. Or not the worst, but even worse than 2023. 2020 being the worst year since we had the COVID-19 
pandemic to deal with. Um, 2024 is gonna probably have, uh, more psychopath monsters just waiting to seek and kill out of all forms of hate. This is John Morris. Have a good day. I'll see you on the next video.